Hello, and in today's video, this is kind of a chicken update. They're all doing well, except for that one right there. She got caught in the door, and her leg appears to be hurt. So what we're going to do is we're going to take her out from the rest of the chickens, and we're going to put a splint on her leg and keep her separate. Okay, we got her out from the, from the lot. We have her here in the back of our truck, and we're going to put a splint on her injured leg. Okay, so upon further inspection, we it seems to be that the chicken is bruised farther up than what we're going to be able to splint. So, what we're going to do, well, we don't really know what we're going to do. We're going to try our best to take care of it, but we don't really know if we're going to be able to do anything for that. The chicken does seem to be in good condition, though, so we're going to go ahead and try our best to do something for her. We, have, we are applying red oil to the bruised area which is an antiseptic mainly meant for cuts and other injuries on people but it can also work on animals as well so we're going to apply some of that and hope for the best I have my five gallon bucket here I'm going to go ahead fill it up and take all the chickens some fresh water okay I have carried the five gallon bucket up here from the water spigot to the chicken lot and I filled this bucket here and this other bucket and they're happy now shortly after giving them water this one got in the nesting box and is acting like it wants to lay an egg it got back out but you never know might lay an egg here soon. So far today, we've gotten nine eggs from 12 chickens. In the short amount of time that I've been recording, it has, it seems to have blown in a passing shower. Okay, the chickens have now been fed and we're gonna go ahead and put the injured chicken back in. Okay, we have applied the red oil we're gonna take her back inside the coop here and hopefully none of these other chickens run out we don't want to get them caught in the door there she is she's still moving around a little bit so she can get food and water if she wants to I guess that does it for our chicken update. We're going to go ahead and end the video off here. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Okay, we've gotten the chickens fed. Now, as you can see here, here's our injured lady. You good chickadee. We give her some food where she's laying at so she doesn't have to get up